Hello everyone, welcome back to the video. Today we are making a video on the recent K-pop releases. I have four releases here today. We have Pose by Lightsome, Crush by Ive, we have Curious by uh, Eunice, and we have also Card, Tell My Mama. I cannot wait to get through all of them, so let's get right into it. Okay, so starting off with Curious by Eunice. I really like this song. I honestly am not a stand of the group because all of them are really young. But, I like the first song they made and I really like this song. I think the song is just better in a way. I don't know what it is, but I just kind of like it more. I think the overall vibe and everything is just really good. And I like the lyrics a lot. I would say, I was not expecting this from them. I was actually expecting something really cutesy. And I do think this has a bit of a cutesy vibe with it, but also being very much like, I'm like, better. <laughs> I don't know. It just has that vibe in a way. It's like, I really like it. The whole concept's really good. And this is their first comeback as a group, so I'm really excited to see what the they're going to do here on out. Because so far, it's been really good music. I cannot wait to see what else they bring out. Overall, I would give it an 8 out of 10. I really like it. Okay, so Pose I really like as well. Actually, more than uh, Curious, to be honest. I really like Pose. It's one of my favorite songs from them, actually. I would not say it's their best, but I will say it's good. I will have to say, though... The budget's really bad on the music video. And even the promotions, they're wearing like the same outfits in every performance. And it's just overall very minimalist. And I wish they did more with it. I feel like they could have done more with it if they even tried. Look, look, look at this. Look at this album cover. It's really cool looking. I like it. But then they bring this out with the music video. After seeing Honey and Spice and being so like happy with it, I was like, this is good. First comeback is OT6 and they did really, really good with it. But this is just not it. I don't know what they were thinking, I don't know what the point was, but it's just not it. They could have done more. Where's that Jiro money at, you know what I mean? But overall, I do really like the song, and I do think that everything is really good about it. And I, I like all the parts. There's no parts I'm like specifically against. I think it's a bit short. I wish there was more to it, but I'm kind of getting used to the short thing now at this point. Everything is really short now. <laughs> Very few songs even make it to the 3 minute mark nowadays. I'll give it a mm, 7.5 out of 10, taking a 0 0.5 for the fact that the budget's really low in this music video, and it's obvious. Alright, now on to Ives' Crush. I really, really like this song, and I didn't even know it was coming out. When I heard it, I was like, wait, this has to be my favorite Japanese release of this year, if not one of them. And it's also probably one of my favorite Japanese releases by Ives in general. I love Wave, and I love queen of hearts but this has to be number one for me so i'm gonna have to say that and um the music video is really pretty i love everything about it um i love all of the lines i will say the bridge was one of my favorite parts as well as the final chorus the high note thing so it was really good and i have really no complaints with the song this is probably the first song so far that we have no complaints about it's just really really good and I'm gonna have to give it, just based off of that, a um, 10 out of 10. I mean, it's a perfect release, I would say. Okay, now on to Card. I was not even added. I'm not paying attention to any releases right now because I follow way too many people. I have way too many groups I stand, and so, and I've been kind of an inactive, so I didn't even know they had a release coming, but I'm so happy to see it, and it's such a good release. I will say, it's not my favorite release by Card. I actually do prefer Icky, their last release, to this release, but it's still good, and I mean, they always release bops, let's be honest, it's no surprise there, and I don't really have any complaints, I think it's good, I love the rap segments from Matthew and JSF, I love the vocals from Soman and Jiwoo, so yeah, it's a good release. I'm gonna say it's a 9.5 out of 10, almost perfect, but not my favorite release by them, still really, really good. And you guys should definitely listen to it if you haven't already. Okay, that's it for this video, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Please leave a subscribe and a like if you want to. And hope you have a good day. Stay healthy and safe. I love you all so much. Bye!